All right, I'm waiting on Doug. It's uh, November the 2nd, and we're going to go another ride. Try to finish up part of what we missed from the last ride uh, where we ran out of time, but we're going to go up, try to hit the War Woman um, trails on War, War Woman Road off of 28 in uh, Georgia, right across the uh, Chattooga River. It's a little cold. I'm wrapped up pretty good. It's like 37 when I left the house, so it's supposed to warm up to in the 50s, but up in the mountains it'll be cooler. So, let's see how it goes. Bullpen Road. It's off of 107 uh, when you cross over into North, North Carolina. Uh, we tried to come this way last time, but they were doing some road work and paving it, so we had to go a different way. But on today's route, we're going to go up to Highlands and uh, get, grab some lunch, let it warm up a little bit, and uh, and then. We're going to leave Highlands and head over to War Woman um, and ride some Jeep trails. Last time I was up there, I noticed a bunch of trails, but I didn't want to take my truck down them because they were too narrow. And uh, so Doug's noticed them too. So we're going to take the bikes out and just see where they go and uh, have a little fun. Try to stay warm. Up here, most of the leaves are gone. The ones that are still here are red. The yellows are, are gone. If you hear me miss a shift occasionally, I got some new boots on and they're not broke in and I am struggling <laughs> to shift gears. Feels like I got a cast on. Gotta break them in. It's gonna be dusty today. We hadn't had any rain probably in a month or so. Everything's a chore with these boots. Having the shifts, standing up's an issue, rear braking's an issue. Just a little bit off my game today, a little slow. And the roads really, it's so dry, the roads just, it's actually. <laughs> I know it sounds crazy, but it's kind of slick. It's not slick, it's, it just slides easy, I guess. The leaves aren't helping either. to the river.
cool bridge cool little waterfall god the water's down the water's pretty low yeah that's what i was just saying it's it is low not much flow going through Woo, my oh really now mine's okay these mittens work it they work good The road's kind of slick, and I mean it's yeah, not. Yeah, there's some places I got. I got on a few places where it got a little loose. I was like, okay. Yeah, I guess it's so dry, everything's just sliding around. Yeah, well, plus I'm probably taking you with dust. Yeah. Yeah, we got a little bit of pavement here. Okay. We're heading over to uh, the war woman there, 106 out of Highlands, and it looks like we've got behind a, uh, a Porsche convoy with a uh, Honda Pilot in the middle. <laughs> Looks like that says three forks. Huh? Three forks? Is that what you... This road... This is hell red. No, the uh, the road that we're going on. It, this? Yeah. I don't know what that is. It says three forks. Alright, All right, we found the first jeep trail 75 I think it's called three forks well. yeah this looks like it yeah well I mean it looks like it looks like stuff's been up through here don't it up here. All right. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry to bother you, picnic. <laughs>
pretty smooth road. A lot of leaves, pine needles on it. I guess that's what you would expect in November. <laughs> Got a little squirrely. Might be fun coming back up. It's pretty steep. Oh, there's a looks like a private gate. Yeah, that's up. That's that private property you were talking about, so... Yeah, we're on the edge of private property. We ain't going in there. Yeah. Well, we can go up and see where that other road goes. I think it dead ends also, but... Yeah. Obviously, you can drive back here. Yeah. Good say, Doug. Probably somebody's hurt back here. Yeah, you're right. All right. All right, we'll go on down and see if we can find another one. This is the uh, Zion Church Cemetery. Wonder if I have services out here. Wonder if it's still out there. That's a pretty big graveyard. Looks like uh, some of the stones are new. A lot of flowers up through there. It's a pretty neat area. You said you found the outhouse? I think that's what that is. Oh yeah. Well, mine don't even show. I think, I think this is it. I think we need to take this. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Three? Yep.
So this is the, what we're trying to do is get back over to uh, War Woman Road. And this is one of the Jeep trails that we found. There was no worm or, I mean, no gate or sign. So, oh, and we got our tree down. Let's see if we can uh, thread the needle here. Oh, I don't have the ground clearance. Ah, uh, we hung on the back. There we go. Oh, this is starting to feel like that. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, you gotta watch the phone. Yeah. Jeez. I just don't have the ground clamped. I didn't hit it fast enough and I don't have the ground clearance. <sighs> yeah, we'll turn around. I get it, hang on. Yes. Oh yeah. Yeah. Probably should hit War Woman if possible. Okay. And uh, get the hell off, get your head towards home. Alright. This is cool. Yeah.
I ain't on dug out hippie. Jeez. You need me to move it? Hang on. I forgot to put Loctite on it. You got your saw with me? Yeah. You just want to get mine? Yeah, is it in your bag here? Yeah. Try to get out of here. You got it?
There's a road over there. Ooh. To the right. Yeah. We gotta be right on the road. I see the road. Yeah, I seen it too. I see the power lines. Oh man. Yeah. a tight turn <laughs> hey there's the uh, Porsche group the Porsche group And we got behind them earlier, where have they been? <laughs> yeah, right. Who went cross country? Yeah. Man. Oh my god, that's that is a great trail. Alright, we're on Bull uh, Burroughs Ford on the Georgia side. So that was a pretty fun ride. Uh, we found a new trail. Got a good, good many miles in today because we didn't bushwhack as much. But uh, the bike done good. Didn't have any issues. The only issues I had today was uh, maybe getting uh, bottoming out on the logs. Doug's got a inch or two more clearance than I do, so he was able to go over it, and uh, I got hung up on it. But anyway, no big deal. And uh, the other issue I had today was just these boots. It was just really tough all day trying to uh, deal, deal with these boots, changing gears and braking and uh, keeping up with Doug. But anyway, it was a good ride. No way I got hurt. And uh, see what we come up with for next time.